guys and people and humans and the trees around we are going to have not another comic yay put your hands together for socrates yeah. Keep going there for Alex. Yeah. Put your hands in the air if you like Dutch medical sentences. Yeah. Look, they try, they do the best they can, and this is it. So yeah, about a year ago, I uh, got me a tattoo. But it's, it's mostly line work. It started with incredible shading, colors, all sorts of, but it all faded, you know. And I am not getting it touched up. Yeah, so I am an American. I'll try it again. I am an American. You got a passport. Oh, you're an anchor baby. Immigrant! Come on, Dutch people. Where you, where's your parents from? It's from where? From the U.S. Oh, so you got to be a, by birthright. Were you born here? Uh, so you're actually almost Dutch. The Dutch consider you almost Dutch. Exactly. Well, that's something. It's Dutch. Which is a thing, you know what I mean? They're, they're their own special people, you know? What's cool is, like, even today, if you ask an American, not you, but other Americans, what's the best country in the world, you know? They'll still say it's America, you know? No hint of irony, no knowledge whatsoever, you know? It's like if you ask an Indian, they'll say, oh, it's India. <laughs> we need a big zoom in with the camera for that. But if you ask a Dutch person the same thing, they'll say, hmm, I think, best country in the world, huh? Hello, the Netherlands? Like, nah, you think? <laughs> it's true, I've asked them. None of them say the Netherlands. They're like, no, this is, this is as good as it gets. I mean, it's prepared for global warming. We'll, we'll do all right here, right? So the dike stands together, you know? It's like I moved to the Netherlands for the food, you know? I stayed for the weather. <laughs> so I spent the last year as the nail in the concept of what's better to be the hammer than the nail. And uh, personal experience, it's true. Being the nail sucked. Hammer can suck too, but I got to tell you, being the nail was no good. Best thing about it was the drugs. Because they give you drugs if you're a nail long enough, you know? And uh, I stopped doing Oxycontin about uh, a week and a half ago. So if anybody's got any Oxycontin, <laughs> give me a call. <laughs> Buyer's market. <laughs> so the other day, though, it got even worse because I got mugged by a Dutch guy. Yeah. I know he was Dutch because he insisted I send him a ticky. I did, of course, 250, you know. But the other, you know, it's like the cops, the cops aren't gonna help, you know what I mean? You, you ask a cop, they don't know what they're doing. You know, like the other day a cop stops me in the park. He comes up to me and says, hey man, what are you doing? I said, I'm just, you know, minding my own business here, you know? I'm, I'm having a gender reveal party. He looks at me and goes, oh, it's a boy. <laughs> Appreciate that. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, have you been shopping? Anybody buy things, food, etc.? It's incredibly expensive now. Getting robbed every time you go to the supermarket. I wanted to buy some fruit with so much money. But it's like you need it because like life without it is fruitless. <laughs> it's a really bad joke I thought of. When I was on Oxycontin, good times. <laughs> yeah, it's like when I got to the hospital, the best moment was she said to me, would you like a shot of morphine? Yeah, I like morphine. Anybody ever done morphine here? A couple of people, you know what I'm talking about? Morphine's like a warm hug on a cold evening, you know? Nothing, yeah, see, see? If you get the chance, somebody in the park offers you a shot of morphine, you take it. Trust me on that thing. Just the one shot I think is good. I liked it a lot. Uh, good times. Who's, uh, who's in relationships? We got relationship people here? You got one there? Oh, you look like you're in a relationship. I hope it's with her. <laughs> Is it? Yeah, yeah. Because, I, I mean, you could be polyamorous, you know what I mean? A lot of people are proud about, you know, their bisexuality, you know, sleeping with everybody, you know. Polyamorous people sleeping with everybody now, you know. 
Nobody celebrates old celibate people. You know, there's all these shows for gays and just Indian folks, but there's no show called Ain't Getting Any, Ain't Looking, neither. I didn't know I was celibate, you know. We're all celibate here today at the moment. It's just a question of how long have you been celibate, you know. The only people who are not celibate is they were in the bush recently. But even so, that guy's celibate for the last five minutes, you know. All right, starting now. But, you know, I found out, like, when it turns out the village walked me to the ocean, put me on a little boat, sent me out by myself. I didn't know. I looked around, found out that I'm out there all by myself.